right, so I got the um, insulation stuck up on the wall. And I'm literally just taking the stuff and ripping it and shoving it into all these little nooks and crannies. Getting it in there as best as I can. Well, I got this wall pretty well insulated. Yes. I'm going to see how the plastic part is. This is a huge improvement over just the metal that was there. It's not the prettiest. We wanted to do nice wood panels, but when I found these at the salvage yard, I just couldn't, couldn't leave them out. All right, well, this side's installed. I think it looks great. Uh, it's a good fit. All in over. I'm fine, don't worry about me. <laughs> it's a good fit along these lines, front and back. Uh, it looks a lot better than what was there before, so I think it's a huge improvement. Uh, a couple of these screw holes didn't, I don't know, the metal wasn't behind it. I was supposed to leave but I'll figure that out later. This side, the insulation is starting to go up. I still have to pack it into all the holes. And then that side will be ready to screw in. There is a forward panel, but I've got a huge window right there. So I'm going to have to cut it out for the window. It is late. I'm going to leave you here for tonight, but for you guys, it'll be right away. Hey friends, I'm back. It's actually been a couple of days. Been a little busy. I did a little bit more work off camera. I got that wall up. I think I did that on camera, but I got this wall up and the insulation up over there. Um, that panel, I have to cut the hole for the window. I got all the insulation shoved in all the holes and everything. Across the top of the window, I didn't put any up there because I think I'm going to um, get the panel screwed to the window frame and then kind of tuck it in from the top. I got the panel over here. I marked out where I think the window goes. Hopefully I got it right because I only have one of these panels and I don't think I can get another one. So wish me luck. I'm going to cut that out and then we'll get it screwed up into the van. Angie's doing some uh, gardening in the background. Say hi, Angie. Hi, uh, everyone. She's going to cut that out in the other I guarantee. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm going to cut this out, see how it fits in the van, and we'll go from there. I messed it up or not. I think it's gonna work. Alright. Now that I got the panel kind of where I want it. Looks like everything's lined up okay. I'm actually going to screw the panel directly into the window frame. Um, instead of just using the self-tapping screws and just running them in, I'm going to pre-drill the holes with the smaller drill bit just to make sure that the screws go exactly where I want them to go. Need some longer screws for this panel part. I'll be right back. Found some, and they even have a matching head on them. I like it. Alright, I'm going to go all the way around, screw this in, and then these panels will be installed. Like I said before, we're probably going to take these back out and paint them because they're kind of dirty and grungy and ugly, but it's better than what was here before, which was nothing. Alright, I think it fits pretty well. Um, I've only got one thing left to do, and that's to cut what's left of the bed liner for the back section. Uh, put the seat back in, the armrest back in. Um, I'd like to cut a piece of carpet for this front section up ahead of the seat, but I don't think you guys need to see that. Cool. 
All right, friends, I think this is where I'm gonna leave you on this installment of budget van life build, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I think it came out a lot better than it was before. Um, these panels at a salvage yard, I spent like 25 bucks for all three of them. So for $25, this is a huge improvement. And a carpet, and carpet pad, hopefully that does a good job insulating. If not, it was free, so no big deal. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. Uh, let me know if you guys have done something similar to this. I'd love to see your builds and uh, maybe get some inspiration from you guys. Thanks for watching. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to say we're getting there.